Hello, my beautiful Aquarius. Welcome to your love reading forecast for what is their true intentions. Now we're gonna examine this for singles, couples, anyone in between, or anyone who needs love messages. We're gonna look at your love interest's true intentions towards you. Are they interested in love? They wanna take it to the next level with the relationship? Let's find out. Also guys, thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. And thank you to my members. I really appreciate all of your support. The Eye of Zen is back up on Amazon.com. So all the information is in the description box below. And also guys, the holiday giveaway is still going on. So stick with me till the end and, and I will give you guys all the details. So my darlings, if you like it this way, you want me to continue doing it this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. You can do both. Let's jump right in. What is my Aquarius's love interest? The one they're here for, the one I know about. What is my Aquarius's love interest? True intentions towards my Aquarius. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Oh my goodness. Aquarius, they want you. Nine of Cups energy. You're everything that they want with a Nine of Cups energy. Okay, let's keep going. Three of Cups, you give them a sense of joy, a sense of celebration. They love spending time with you with the Three of Cups energy. They are a little bit defensive about getting hurt. So for some of you, there may be friends involved with this situation, okay, with the Three of Cups coming out. They may be concerned that there may be another person involved with the situation with the Three of Cups coming out, which this person's a little bit defensive about. They're like, whoa, I better keep my guard up here. I'm not trying to get hurt because you know what? Aquarius is everything that I want, but there may be other people that may be checking them out, may be interested in them, and I really don't want to get hurt here with the Nine of Wands energy coming out. Let's keep going here, Aquarius. And also, let's find out why this camera is not focusing. Okay, there we go. All right, so we got the Hangman energy. We have the Sun card energy. We have the Tower card energy. Oh my goodness, Aquarius. All right, let's keep going. All right, so this person is trying to see new perspective. Uh, they are a bit stuck here, okay, in getting what they want. They really want this happy energy here with you, with the Sun card coming out. They're concerned about everything falling apart here with the Tower card energy. Okay, because a tower card can be some shocking surprise that happens and it happens suddenly, it's unexpected, you know, and, and this person's just like, I really just want to be happy with them. I want to have a good time. I want to spend time with them. And I really want to sacrifice some things here so I can be happy with them. So some big changes can happen here with the tower card energy. Let's get more information here, Aquarius. Aquarius's love interest, the one they're here for. The one they want to know about. What is Aquarius with love interest? True intentions towards them. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. All right, what's this Nine of Cups about? Fox card. Bear card. Rider card. So it's like, can I be honest with them, Aquarius? They're like, can I be honest with you? I really want to take control of things and I want to pay you a visit. Um, I really want some kind of good news here with the writer card energy. I really want to fulfill my desires here with the writer card energy. What is this hangman about? They really want to make some kind of decision here with a scythe card coming out. They want to cut away barriers in their way there with the scythe card energy. So their intentions is to cut away things that seem to be stuck in the connection. The whip card is saying to me that they don't want to get hurt here, okay? The whip card is telling me that they are concerned about this hurt energy, right? When it comes to this abrupt decision. There we go. They want an opportunity here with the key card energy. Let's keep going here, Aquarius. Aquarius's love interest, the one they're here for, the one they want to know about. What is Aquarius's love interest? True intentions towards Aquarius. 
the currents in E to C. Show me the currents I need to C. There we go, the socializing card. See, I feel like they have concern that there's other people involved. Family, friends, or other people. They really have the strong chemistry towards you, Aquarius. And they do want to make the effort here, you see? They feel like the great, this is a great love for them, and they really do want to make an effort here in this connection. Here we go. They're challenged here. They know there's some negative and unhealthy obstacles in their way, and they're trying to be careful about that. So when it comes to the sense of happiness here and hoping that luck is on their side when it comes to the sense of hurt and pain, also the whip card could talk about chemistry and passion, like the sexual union card, they're trying to gain knowledge here about the situation because they are missing you, okay? Because this person does miss you. So they want to go out, okay? And they want to um, come together in a passionate way and make an effort to overcome the challenges, to gain knowledge because they are missing you. Queen of Wands, King of Wands, Hermit card energy. So again, you can see Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. They are definitely feeling very passionate about you. So their intentions is very passionate in nature. And they really, they're really thinking about this deeply. Really thinking about this deeply. They're like, you know what, Aquarius, you are the best decision for me when it comes to this chemistry and passion. I feel so strongly about you. And I've really looked at this and I'm hopeful because it's like almost like a star here for me. This person's really went in deep here and they've kind of examined this like, you know what, there's nobody else like Aquarius. They are so passionate to me. I don't understand why I have such a passionate chemistry with this person. I just don't understand the connection and I really need to look at this deeply. So because they have this strong chemistry and passion with you, they're really examining it very deeply. We have the fish card energy, we have the clouds card energy, and we have the doll card energy. See, emotionally, there's a sense of confusion here because of loyalty or friendliness, okay? So there's a lot of emotions that play with this person with the fish card coming out. And I, as I said, I feel like this person's like, I don't understand. Why is this connection so like this for me? You know what? I'm so confused. I have such chemistry for them and I don't know why. Yeah, and it's like, like, I need to make the best decision. Maybe I need to lean on a friend for support here with the doll card energy, or maybe I just need to be friendly with them. I need to get to the bottom of this. There's the romantic feeling. So now we see this person not only feels a lot of chemistry and passion towards you, Aquarius, but they also, they also feel that there is romantic feelings here, okay? Yeah, there is opportunity of true love here, Ace of Cups energy. And I feel like this person's like, yes, this is my soulmate connection. Aquarius is my soulmate connection. So they're just wanting to go out and overcome these challenges because of these romantic feelings that they have for you. They have this chemistry and passion. They want to gain knowledge about this opportunity of true love, new love, all right? They want to make the effort because they do miss you and they want a relationship here or they have a sense that you're their soulmate connection. Let's keep going down here another layer. <clears throat> How do I be honest with you about this decision when it comes to my emotions? How do I gain control of this hurt and pain and this confusion? I really want to visit you. I want my desires fulfilled and this opportunity towards loyalty here. I want to be friendly to you with the doll card energy. Let's keep going down another layer here. You can see here, right? So let's just put this in focus here. 
The central theme, what is it saying? The central theme is saying they feel happy with you. You're everything that they want. They have chemistry and passion. They're really examining this deeply with the Hermit card energy. They are defensive about getting hurt, possibly because of friends, or they may feel like there's another person involved with the situation. They're afraid that things are gonna come crashing down here with the Tower card energy, and they wanna make some kind of sacrifice here because they want this happy energy. They want this happy ending with you, okay? With the Sun card coming out. I feel like this person really just wants to be happy with you and fulfill their desires here. And they're really looking at this very deeply. Yeah. All right, my beautiful Aquariuses. I love you guys so much. If you guys like that, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. I will see you guys in another date or two with your weeklies. Also, my darlings, for the holiday giveaway, all you have to do is put blessed and love in the comments below. I'll be picking two people for a free personal reading and one for the holiday gift giveaway. I love you guys so much. I hope you guys have a great rest of your next couple days, and I will see you guys soon.